Tonight at 6, sanitation agencies in Marin are turning food waste into watts of electricity. The Food to Energy program was launched today. It aims to cut fossil fuel use and landfill waste by converting food scraps into a renewable energy source. Crown Force John Fanolio is in Marin and shows us how it works. The process starts here at the Marin Sanitation Service, where 20 tons of food scraps every week are collected from local businesses, then separated from trash headed for the landfill. An important component in removing food waste from landfills because... About 15% of the effects of global warming are as a result of putting organics into the landfills. In fact, food waste is the largest single source of solid waste in California. In the landfill, it can become volatile. It puts off a number of gases that are damaging to the environment. Within the next couple of years, there will be organic spans or food and green waste spans at the landfill. Once all of that food waste has been sorted and ground up, it is then brought here to the Central Marin Sanitation Agency, where it is combined with fats, oils, and grease to create methane gas. In other words, think of this process as a giant industrial stomach. The methane gas produced by this giant stomach is then used as a fuel to run generators that produce electricity. trying to mix and get a, a good consistency of like a puree and what that's going to do is is make our biogas production just skyrocket. The sanitation agency uses the biofuel to power their wastewater facility. It has reduced its reliance on natural gas by roughly 50 percent, saving taxpayer dollars. They say there is the potential to send electricity from these biofuels back to the grid. So the community benefits from this by them being able to create their own energy from methane gas from food waste. Now the Central Marin Sanitation Agency is one of only a few companies in California that are converting food waste into renewable energy, and they hope that their efforts will serve as a model for other companies to follow suit in the future. Reporting in Marin, John Finolio, Cron 4 News.